so this digital image is partially a reference from Unsplash and some of my own textures um, for the background there and the, I wanted um, these images to look like they were manipulated on a photocopier and then drawn into so that's why they're sort of stretched and, and warped a bit this one's probably the least obvious one but I did try and push it quite a lot and then the the printing uh, it went a little better than the the previous one stretch but I still had to um, redo the background uh, just none of the backgrounds seem to pull from from the the laser print uh, so I just made them up with paint to get the same kind of feeling but um yeah I had to put the the uh, the figure on twice just the legs I didn't bother too much about the accuracy of the sort of shadow reflections part but the the, the top part um, yeah I, I redid to get some definition in there I, I still end up drawing into it partially because it's not perfect uh, and partially because that's the the look I had on the first one and I want to keep keep the same look So here's that first failed pull. You can see the kind of lack of definition in there. Again with a another one here. And then, yeah, it's just touched up with Posca pens at the end. Yeah, you can, you can see there, it's got much better definition. Um, and of course I have to cut out the, the mask again for the background, uh, not to stop, stop the stop it printing onto the background so I hope you enjoy the rest of the process and uh, perhaps I'll see you in the next one thanks for watching If you do like this feel free to check out the others in the series or the series before this where I'm also doing gel printing uh, otherwise there's some digital drawing and painting tutorials on the channel thanks a lot okay bye